So exciting reading this and you know getting that continuation of the story from Rebels. Um, and Ahsoka actor Rosario Dawson has acknowledged that as of January 2024, Disney has not taken any official action about a second season of the titular Heroines solo television series, which is a devastating blow to the franchise's three surviving fans. On the January 4th episode of Dagobah Dispatch, an entertainment weekly podcast featuring Star Wars and hosted by Devin Coggin and Dolphin Ross, the actress behind the force adept to Bruton's live-action appearance provided an update on her potential comeback to the role. Dawson's time on the show Timestamp 167 began with Coggin asking their guest, How are you feeling now that the show is out there? To which the actress responded, It's been insane. Dawson joined the pair to explicitly discuss her time on Ahsoka. It's been incredible. It was like a picture of a girl dressed like Ahsoka that Dave Filoni sent me and I was like, all right, that's so sweet, Dawson remembered. I was moved to tears when I saw a video of a pre-screening of the first two episodes that was broadcast all over the world. People were dressed to the nines, there were audiences with lightsabers and other accessories, and there were step and repeats, a term used by the industry to describe the pattern backdrops that guests at an event use for photos. The studio was unable to work with us, so I had to watch the first two episodes of the show with everyone else and wait for it to air before I could see it. I can still clearly recall how amazing it was. I mean, this is really big. The former Marvel Netflix actress went on to describe her experience in a galaxy far, far away, saying and the fact that it did so well without us being able to do any promotion just speaks volumes to this world and this story and just how much it means to people and has meant for generations. And to see it from a distance, I've been so emotional that I've been able to contain my anxiousness. I've been pretty emotional about it these past sort few of months. Sort of effortless and, and still be driven. So suddenly it was there. Boom. Able to. Dawson continued, I've been screenshotting pictures for people and I love the reactions people have sent. I've been sharing behind the scenes info and photos really piecemeal. To be honest, I'm still overwhelmed. So I haven't really done a few proper foot entries talking about how much the crew, the cast, and the entire experience meant to me. Like, I'm not really sure how to describe it. It's also been really traumatic because Luke has stone costume designer, Shauna Treptik, and actor Ray Stevenson, who played Balin Skull, are no longer with us. Dawson went on to express her gratitude for the upcoming holidays in light of the unexpected emotional roller coaster. She said, Oh, thank God, because I need a moment still to keep taking this all in and just seeing the reaction before jumping back into it again, which I hope we do, that we get to, and that she was grateful that we have the holidays to go into. Because even now with the strike over, there's no work, really, to be done.